Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the channel. So, you're probably like, hey, wasn't your spring break last week? Why are you not at school? Um, so I'm taking a break from school to focus on my social media. Kidding. Um, but now I am taking a leave of absence from school right now because, um, yeah, my mental health is just not great. Um, I'll probably go into that another time, but for now, just know that we're going to be together a lot more, so yay! Um, so currently, we're up at the vacation house, um, and I thought I'd bring you guys through a little, like, Sunday reset type video. Um, so yeah, um, basically, I just put in a load of laundry and the other things we need to do are take out the trash in my room because i have like a huge pile of, not pile like bag of trash like filling up um i need to reorganize my bathroom and i'm not sure what else we'll see all right here i am upstairs and let's let's get all this trash out of my room because the lord knows how long this has been sitting here um, yeah, I literally have like a giant bag full of stuff. And then more in my actual trash can. Alright, and then as any young adult does, I have like 7 million cups up here, so let's take those downstairs with us. Okay guys, so it's much later in the day, and I decided that I was not gonna try to get everything done in one day. I'm not gonna put any time constraints on this video. Um, I just wanna like kind of get things together, but I'm gonna do it at my own pace. So our other um, housekeeping item is to take a shower because it's been a minute and my hair is definitely greasy. I burnt my scalp on spring break, so I also really wanna like pull oil, oil in it and use this thing in the shower to like try to get the flakes off so stand by while i oil my hair okay for you guys to say i'm not gonna move my head at all but just trust that i got a lot of the flakes loose and now i'm gonna go take a shower all right, not sure why I did that. Okay, so I washed my face in the shower, but I'm just gonna put on my Adepoline gel, and I haven't used it in like a bit, so I'm just gonna mix it with my Cetaphil because I am not trying to be a crust monster, so. But, um, how is everyone else doing? Clearly, I'm not doing well, but. What about the rest of you? Is anyone slaying right now? I hope so. Okay, so it's a couple days later, and we're finally gonna actually organize the bathroom. So, let me show you what we're working with right now. This shelf I've been using for um, makeup and like my nail stuff. And then in here, um, not really sure, but then this bottom cabinet I'm using for my hair things. So, first we are gonna move all the stuff that's not mine because people keep putting their stuff on my shelves because they want storage, <laughs> my parents. Um, so let's do that first, and then we'll get into some organization from there. All right, finito. So, now I think I'm gonna try to put all my skincare in like the mirror cabinet. I'm pretty sure I have attempted that before, but somehow it just keeps getting mixed up. But anyways, I'm gonna put you back on time lapse and we're gonna do it.
Okay, so I ended up doing all my nail stuff over here, makeup, hair, extra stuff down here, and then my essential skincare, miscellaneous, and more miscellaneous stuff. But yeah, basically, that's what I did. Um, I feel pretty good about it, so yay, small steps. Um, yeah, I'll update you if I decide to do any more rearranging this week. Um, or I might just include kind of random segments. I'm just kind of making a vlog at this point, honestly. <laughs> but yeah. Hey ladies, I forgot to tell you that I went to Target. Um, or maybe I did, I can't remember, but I'll show you what I got. So I got a refill of this, which is my eyes twitching. The Garnier Fructis Air Dry Curl Cream. I've been using this for years. If anyone knows a formula that's like this, it's from a better brand, please let me know. Cause I know Garnier probably has like silicones in it or whatever, but it just like, it's just the right consistency for my hair. Um, I bought this Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen and Restore Treatment Mask. So I'm gonna try that out. Um, and I also got these shorts from Colsey is the brand, I think. I'm not gonna show you the full view, but they're really cute. And I got them in orange too, which I'll show you in a bit. But I realized, okay, first of all, why does one side of my hair look way better? Second of all, I realized um, I never put away my laundry from the other day, so we should do that. All right, so here are the other Target shorts I bought. Like, they're kind of giving with the colors. So I'm definitely gonna need to buy the matching like tops eventually because they have them and I'm like, slay. But our Target just stinks. Like it's kind of like the worst ever. Um, which is weird because the one we go to is in like a big town. I guess maybe it's even technically a city, but no. Anyway, so let's fold my laundry and let's talk about what's going on in my life. So basically I'm taking a leave of absence from school because my mental health has been really not good. Um, but it's okay, I'm getting help and it's all gonna be okay, so Basically, I had the option to either do a medical withdrawal or just withdraw from my courses. Um, and since there's one class that I have that's online that I was like, I feel like I can still do that. I just did like a course withdrawal basically instead of having to do like a full semester withdrawal. So yeah. Um, I'm meeting with someone on Monday about my issue, basically. Um, so that's good to know. Like, I'm not gonna say I'm like excited, but I'm ready for answers. So that's gonna be snazzy. <laughs> and then just kind of having to learn how to deal with life. So I was like, there's just no way that I can do school, work, my research, keep up with my social life and not be absolutely miserable, like trying to manage um, my mental health. So I was like, there's no better time than now to do this. And my family has been very supportive, shout out to them. So yeah, um, you're gonna be seeing me a lot more because I'm not gonna be doing as much stuff. Um, I did apply for a job, but it's part-time and I choose my own hours, so I might not be working a ton, but I was like, I should do be doing at least something to make money instead of just, you know, sitting around all day. You know, sometimes life just takes you in a different direction than you're planning to go in. But yeah, I will be going back in the fall, so... That's exciting and you know, school's always gonna be there. Um, I think I might end up doing a little more like part-time after next semester, 
like next semester I kind of want to catch up and do my normal course load but after that I think I might do um like three classes in my research instead of four classes in my research because we do have for our school I am a bio major I don't know if I all oh right I did that video about a day in my life um so our labs for any class that you have that has like a lab co-requisite the labs are like three to four hours so it's still gonna be plenty of time in the lab and stuff but but yeah, I was like, what's the rush to graduate in four years or even people who graduate in like three years? You know, I'm like, for me, I'm not in any sort of rush. And it's like, I'll be paying the same amount because, you know, that it's less money to be a part-time student. Um, and I'm like, if I'm gonna graduate after 2024 anyways, which would be my normal four year track from high school, I might as well like take my time um, and not just cram it all into one one or two like semesters because I could do basically like next summer and fall and graduate then but I'm like I'd rather just like enjoy my life and like take it slow because school is always going to be there um, but like yeah I don't want to put myself in a situation where I'm stressing myself out well more than I already do <laughs> you know so yeah, that's basically what's been happening recently, um, and I don't know, I'm definitely not feeling like my most amazing, but I have a lot of amazing family and friends around me, and that makes me feel better, and I'm slowly, you know, trying to get back into some sort of routine so that I feel a little more, I don't know, put together, I guess. But how is everyone else doing? Um, I hope you're all well. Or if you're not well, I hope you're on the way there at least. Uh, if you have any video suggestions, feel free to let me know um, in the comments what you would want to see. Because like I said, I'm going to be around. So I have more time to focus on my social media. <laughs> um, I'm definitely thinking of possibly doing some like shopping with me videos because you guys seem to like those. Um, and I might try to do some sort of like more day in the life type videos um, and kind of take you along with me on my journey. But yeah, that's basically what's going on. All right, girlies, um, I decided to end the video here. Hope you guys are having a great day. And I will talk to you so soon. Bye.